Thank you. Yes. Well Holly, great shot. Mike, thanks very much indeed. Now, many of us of a certain age, not us two obviously, but some people will remember the likes of Danger Mouse and Chilton and the Wheelies. Children's TV made in Manchester by the Cosgrove Hall animation team. Well, the same company is now introducing us to brand new characters, but with all the likability of the old ones. Pip the dog and Alba the cat are already winning the hearts of a new generation. So our reporter Tim Scott popped into their studios to bring us this report. Come join the party down in Salty Cove. If you haven't seen Pippa Hall yet, well, your children probably have. Currently wowing the little ones on Channel 5, it's the latest in a long, long line of TV shows made in Manchester by the pioneering animation studio Cosgrove Hall, now renamed Cosgrove Hall Fitzpatrick. Pippa Hall is our new show, so it's our first show back. Um, it's set around the seaside town of Salty Cove. And we're very proud of it. It's about having fun, how days down at the beach and the seaside were as kids and the adventures you get into. Cosgrove Hall was originally founded in Chalton in 1976 and was responsible for the likes of Danger Mouse, Count Duckula and Wind in the Willows. In those days, the cartoons were created with stop-frame animation where models were painstakingly moved around by hand. Now, though, the company has a new headquarters in Didsbury and nearly everything is done on a computer. One of the first things that we have to do is actually make the story work. And to do that, we make a thing called an animatic. So you make a, a little sketch animation? In yeah, that. yeah, we do. We, we take black and white drawings. Mm -hmm. They're very quick to do relatively. And we can work out the story. We can make it work because we end up with a whole story told as this black and white set of drawing. When they're happy with the story, the animators then add colour and sound to finish the whole thing off. At the moment, they're working their way through 52 episodes of Pippa Hoy and they've more new shows in the pipeline. It seems Manchester is once again a centre of excellence for TV shows that kids just can't get enough of. Tim Scott, ITV News, Didsbury. Lovely. Now, let's get the latest weather forecast.